Chapter 7, The Spider's Web the part-time hero stuff is right here i had to go check my footage real quick as to where i was when i started talking to ilyu jin that actor that we literally just talked to we were all the way over here i was like i was so into the soul story that i didn't even realize what was going on your boy is wondering what caused the leap from here to all the way over here as we've never been in this exact spot with of course dragon cart being right here and then we still have that boss over here we need to deal with. I think I'm strong enough to handle him now, but I'm not going to do it yet because we don't have a full party now. But the sub story is here. I'm probably going to go over here and make my way down there and so on and so forth before we start the sub story over there. I don't know what sub story that is there, but it's inside the building. Okay. Ooh, Scorpion. Bug Enthusiast. Oh, my insect went up to level three. Yes. And I can't get around it. Do I go around this way? Oh, of course, it's this one. I thought I was only able to go one. What? What is this? Oh, she never seen a boy's bathroom. ま、ってる時間が永遠にも感じるよね。そんな時に出てくる人がいると神に見えるぜ。本当。あ、really? I'm happy it's a hero quest because I've had enough of this being a sub story in former Yakuza games. I've lost track. Is this like the third time in a Yakuza game this happened or am I wrong? When I go to a stall and someone needs fucking paper. Uh, I'm gonna need some backup here. So this guy needs paper but I can't, it doesn't seem like I can help him. I thought I could but I guess not. I guess we'll go to the other location. Doesn't seem like it'll let me do anything there. I'm guessing it, since I don't have the item, maybe that's why. But I thought I could interact with them, but it doesn't seem like I can. So that kind of sucks in that regard. So all I can do now is just kind of do my own thing until then. Pretty cool that this is new territory up here. Whatever this is. The Bunsana. Ooh, this area looking fancy. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Why did this street right here remind me of Yakuza 3? Oh, uh, this is... That's too much of a vibe right there. So, okay. SOS, someone needs help. Cool. Ooh, is this a shrine that could donate to? No, it's not. Wait, what is this place? Looks pretty unique. Also, this thing at the statue is most likely a bug. Ooh, a dragonfly. Ha <laughs> ha. All right. Anyways, let's help this guy out. Oh my god! I just blocked and he did crit damage to me. What the f Bro, you need to chill the fuck out. Holy shit. That was scary. Because if I got hit by the full extent of that attack, that would have hurt, I bet. Yes, going on a shopping spree in a heavily populated area comes with its own risk. If I run into any more trouble during my vacation, I'll ask you for your help again. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Take on now, thank you. Mission complete. Aha! Ooh, work gloves. It might come in handy. Alright. That's pretty much it for this location. I love to explore what's ever down here, but I'll leave I'll leave that to another sub story. Okay, a new territory up here. This the ice cream man, or ice cream woman, unless I get crepes here. Which would be pretty nice to be able to see what's going on there, but Rather not for now, I should focus on what's going on over here. It seems to be here. So what's going on? 
So much for having a quiet day. Where's that dang bodyguard? And that must be my quiet time. I'll play part time hero. Aha! 20,000 yen. Let's do it. A thuggler. Skater boy. I don't care about the skater boy. What's a thuggler, bro? A radical drop. Oh, damn! Okay, okay. I'll give it to you, skater boy. Anyways, here's the kicker. I'ma finish you off. Thank you. In the ass. All around. Looking good, bro. You threw it down for... <laughs> turned down for what, but I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Holy crap, that was smooth. I totally would have fought along with you, but uh, I'm wearing my best outfit. Yeah. If you're seriously calling out your best outfit, all I gotta say, bud, is that you're doing okay, but I wouldn't call that the best. Ah, we are a junior hero, boys. Let's go. That means when we get more of these to appear in the future, some things will definitely change. But there is other ones down here we can really look forward to. And the other two subs that we have not interacted with. But then we do have these that we need to continue. Wait. What is this? There's a sub story that continues over here? But what is over there? I can't even see what it is. Okay. I'll definitely have to check that out next. Holy crap. I want to open up the map a bit in this area and I happen to come across this. So I am a little curious. Is it anything special? Nothing? Ooh. Oh, insects went up. Cool. Oh, well, it felt like showing that. Okay, this substrate seems to reside near over here. Oh. What the heck? Is it you, my guy? Why don't I, I guess someone's probably gonna need some kimchi in their life, so let's see it. Guy in some clothes. This sucks. How am I supposed to rebuild my form from scratch? Ooh. Hey, you alright? You didn't hurt your leg or anything, did you? <clears throat> oh no, it's nothing like that. You see, I'm a sprinter on a track team. I'm trying to improve my time. You look pretty athletic, my dude. What, what's wrong? What's bothering you? Yeah, well, when I asked my coach for advice, he told me I should work on my form or I'll never get any better. Hey, that is pretty important, actually. But whenever I try to fix my posture and try to focus on breathing and all that, my time just gets worse and worse. I guess I just need to pick up a style and run with it if you catch my drift. Hey. Hey, I have an idea. Take the kimchi with you. You might get used to that speed. Hey, you'll get it eventually. Just keep putting in work. You say that, but it feels like all this work is getting me nowhere. It's like I haven't made any progress at all. Oh. Poor guy. As much as I want to help, I don't know the first thing about Trek. Not really sure what form you're talking about either. <laughs> I could give him that form. <laughs> <laughs> uh, though I do remember Bizan running pretty quick. Was it because he ate that kimchi? Yeah, that shit is real spicy. Kind of remember running my ass off too. <laughs> hey, are you alright? Why'd you get all quiet? Oh, no reason. Maybe if I give him some of this killer kimchi, he could run as fast as he wants, probably straight to the bathroom, but still. Ah, <laughs> uh, but the kimchi's too hot, he might pass out mid run. I just give it to him anyway. Yes, sir. Ooh. Hey, I got an idea. Try this. Try my special edition kimchi. It's very special and it might actually soothe your desire. Take a look into this. It is a whole despair if you don't actually take it seriously. Huh? Try what? Kimchi? Yeah, there's a special pepper in there called Devil's Claw. I think it might help you with your problem. Oh. Okay, so now I'm confused. <laughs> What's kimchi have to do anything with my running for him? You'll find out. Just take a bite. I still don't know what you're getting at, but if you insist. This this is just regular kimchi. Oh. Kinda spicy? No wait. It burns! <laughs> oh look at that run, yes, it burns, it burns. Uh, 
Hey, uh, how was it? It, it was perfect. <laughs> this is exactly what I'm looking for. That run I just had was amazing. Oh, great. Found what you were looking for. Right. Yep. As my mind succumbed to the searing heat and pain, I could feel my ego dissolving for a moment. It felt like I was falling through reality and then I, I became a god. Looks like that old man's cookie will come into use for him's sake. If I could just keep it up, I'll shatter my record in no time. Then the national record is next. <laughs> uh, well, glad I could help. Hey, you really did. And to keep the kimchi infused god mode alive, I'm going out running again. I give you my thanks, Spice Bear. Ooh. Uh, yeah, sure. Good luck. Huh. To think this crazy kimchi actually had to use. That old man just didn't know how to use it. That's fine. Maybe I'll share some with the others who could use a little kick in the ass. Not that I expect to find that too often. Oh, right. That old lady. Wonder if she crossed the street yet. She can't still be struggling. Maybe I'll check her just in case. Uh, don't tell me they're gonna do something I've never seen in a substory series or in any Yakuza game. Are they gonna combine substories together and make me give her the kimchi so that she can cross the street? Well, we'll see when I actually get back down there. So yeah, <laughs> this is insanity. I'm enjoying this so far. I gotta say, taxis in this game have helped me out a lot more in this game than any Yakuza game so far, so I just want to talk about this real quick. You see, being able to fast travel on this map is a big plus because at the beginning of this playthrough, I had to unlock the areas for me to have access to the taxi, including doing certain substories for these to appear. So not just unlocking the map, but doing certain substories as well. I don't know why. It's like this, or at least it feels like this anyway. I just felt like I need to share this, because, uh... Holy crap, this is by far the only Yakuza game where I've never felt so accomplished to be able to fast travel from taxi to taxi. I am not joking. Okay, so on to the sub-story side of things. There is something going on here. Oh, it's this... These people... Wait, why do I care about these people? I should be going back to Megumi who's over there. Well, we can make our way in a usual fashion with that. So, what's going on here anyways? Man, you gotta be crapping me right now, you know what I'm saying? Who does that girl think she is with her stupid little pawn cat? She messed up the whole scam. I'm sorry she actually needs the money compared to your ass. She's talking about Megumi. All good. She just got lucky this time. Don't worry about it. Uh, we could have gone for Yaki Nika if not for her. Now we're stuck with fast freaking food. I'm I'm pissed, man. Feel like or feel how the shadow or the light the donation box is. I don't know what the hell I'm reading anymore. It's late for me. I'm sorry. Not like you're the only one suffering. I got my motorcycle to worry about. Really? It seems like the rumor about these two are true. Man, we gotta do something about that kid. <laughs> okay, fine. We see her at our spot again. We'll crust the little crap. Little shit. Alright, let's see it. Uh, I'm gonna beat that guy's ass if you don't mind. Hold on a sec, guys. Oh. What the hell do you want, pups? Wait, you were with the kid. Collecting donations only to spend it all on yourselves. How low can you get? <laughs> Uh, you eavesdropping on us? How can I not? You're too loud. I literally say that to people in real life, too. If you're gonna talk that loud and expect me not to listen, come on now. Those donations are more than just money. A lot more. That shit is people's hope. Their desire to grow bigger than themselves by helping someone else. First, you trample all over everyone's goodwill, and now you're talking about crushing a little girl. Not on my fucking watch. Their goodwill? Dude, so cringy, ain't Says you, who's an ugly ass boy. Yeah. How about we two grants here a lesson? It'll make getting rid of the brat much easier. Wow, you really don't know the hell you're <laughs> talking to. Yeah, and maybe we could squeeze a donation from him while we're at it. <laughs> oh, I'm actually laughing here. I'd love to see you try. Yeah. Oh, tough guy we got here. Die. 
Oh, unfortunate. You're weak to that. Uh, how unfortunate. How unfortunate. The biggest fall with the biggest egos. Gotta love it. Okay, okay. We've learned our lesson. We'll leave the kid alone. You jerks. Do you even know why she's collecting donations? Huh? No, no idea. I'm sure you guys saw how hard she's working back there. Listen up. So it was for her little brother. We we're so focused on mine, we didn't even bother listening to her. It doesn't even matter that they. I, I don't even give a crap what they say. They're, they're such assholes. That girl barely knows which way's up, but she's out there doing her best just so she can help her brother. Uh. Putting that into perspective, what you guys were doing sounds pretty shitty, doesn't it? <laughs> Uh, on top of that, she even says she looked up to you for trying to help kids in need. Mm -hmm. Yeah, look what you did, buddy. I won't say anything about you two to Megan. I mean, she's already going through a lot with her brother. Last thing she needs is anything that'll bring her down. Man, I feel like a real ass. Oh, you didn't notice. <laughs> oh, I don't even care what you have to say, you bitch. All right. Now that that's out of the way, I need to get back to Megumi over here, but... Wait. What the hell is this over here? Alright, this is the old lady, but what the... What is that? I can only have one thought of what it is, but it's not what I think it is, so I don't know what this is over here. Well, it doesn't matter. No reason to stop recording. Everything's really close to each other. So with that in mind, we could go to Weddleburg over here and talk to our kid over here. Oh, there he is. That's good. Little man. Mm. Noboru. Forgot his name. Now, what should I get today? Oh, Noboru's here. Looks like he hasn't eaten. Maybe now would be a good time to catch up? Yes, it does. Keep him company, why not? I had a feeling we're going to have to do this Yo. anyways. Yo, Noboru. Oh, Kasuka san. You came back. I sure did. So, you hungry? You bet. Ah, uh, the dinosaur looking good, but that burger up there with the face is real ugly. Oh, man, I'm stuffed. Hey, you eat like a dinosaur, no bro. Oh, yeah? Then you eat like a... a mutant dinosaur. By the way, how old are you, kid? I'm nine, but ten's just around the corner. Damn, that's a lot of courage to go into a place like this by yourself at nine. Oh, so you got yourself a birthday coming up. What you asking mom for? Huh? Our kids supposed to get their presents or get presents on their birthday. I mean, I'm not that I ever did. Mm. Oh yeah. Were you some kind of troublemaker? I could kind of see it. Okay, chill out. Yeah. Hey, I wasn't that bad. Okay, maybe I was, but that wasn't the reason at all. <laughs> I just didn't have any parents to give me anything. Oh yeah. Really? Really? I'll top it all off, my birthday's on New Year's, and I never got New Year's presents either. A double dose of tragedy every year. Damn. Ah, uh, then maybe I should stop feeling sorry for myself. What, what, there's no reason to feel sorry for yourself if that's what you're talking about. I wasn't trying to say that, I was just, anyway, if you could have a single present, anything you wanted, what would it be? Mm. Oh, that's easy. It'd be the red baseball glove that Taniyama Sporting Goods at Tani Taniyama Sporting Goods. It's modeled after Sotoyama, you know, from the Major League. That's why it's so popular and rare. Let me guess, it's a lot. I try not to ask my mom for much, but I really, really want this. So I told her about the glove, but I bet she just forgot. <laughs> oh, I don't say that. I'm sure she's got a lot going on, but maybe she'll pull through for you. I have a little faith. Okay, I'll try. Thanks, mister. Well, it's getting to be that time about when kids your age should be home doing their homework. Ah, uh, yeah, you're right. Guess time flies when you're having fun. See you later, Kasuka son. Later. Oh. So, the bird wants a baseball glove from Taniyama Sporting Goods. Hope his mom really does remember. 
something telling me she's easily not going to remember, because that's just how shite goes. Anyways, it looks like Sporting Goods is probably all the way down here, as I don't know what the hell this over here is. I'm hoping that's what that is, but... There's still two subs right down there that hasn't been tested. Oh, ladies here. I, I don't know why I do this every time, but I feel like I have to remember things, because... I'm trying to keep my eye on the things that I don't know, like this over here. <laughs> well, anyway, since those guys that I beat up earlier that were causing a ruckus with donations, hopefully I can talk to uh, your girl over up here. Megumi, how are you doing? Let's see how you're doing. Aw, what's wrong? Megumi. うかないほどだ。なんかあったのか。あ、かすがさん。あのね、いつもあそこでお金集めてた人たち。最近来ないんだ。ああ、そうか。お嬢ちゃん、ちょっといい。あ、もう昨日ね、ちょっと。あ、
Yeah, see, I knew they'd be perfect for a headline, something along the lines of, Oh, how about this? Yusama's at it again, former star turns savage. That's <laughs> cringy. Not bad if I do say so myself. I'm about to earn a lobster dinner here. Ooh. What the hell are you talking about? It's obvious, isn't it? These pictures are gonna be worth a fortune. People find out you assaulted someone not once but twice. What not life itself be over for you? The fact that you're really like buttering this up makes me want to beat your ass. Like you don't deserve <laughs> this. Yeah, he doesn't deserve this, but you don't deserve to be doing this to somebody. Like, what's wrong with you? Look, I'll make you a deal. I chant for you the picture. You fuck over 50 mil. So I'll price to pay for your entire future. What the fucking hell? That's that's more than just crazy. I'm really about to beat your ass. All right, hold up. Whatever went down at the bar between him and me, nothing happened, and that's the end of it. No one cares what you say. All I need to do is take the shit out of content, and that's what people believe. Creative liberties, you know. Now, I hope you're not thinking of going around explaining to each and every person your version of what happened. <laughs> Don't didn't think so. So if I were you, I would just give me the money. That's not hard. That's not hard of a choice. Oh, I have an option. Nah, I have an option. You're right. There isn't a choice at all. Oh. Yeah. You're not paying a single yen to this fake ass punk. I know a scam when I see one. <laughs> Kasuga son. Nah. You delete those pictures now, or I won't let you step on his career. What? You think you can intimidate me? You think I'm some kind of charity? Wow, you want to keep talking? I'm going to let you keep talking. I'm used to big scary guys like you. People who think writers like me are powerless. And I teach them a lesson. Oh, yes, I do. Oh, you are asking for it. Maybe I should share s uh, the same lesson to you. A lesson of pure pain. <laughs> Let's do this. Well, still going to be stubborn, I see. Then I'll just have to add another article. <laughs> From journalist to hero, the man who stopped Ilyu Jin and his Yakuza pal. Oh, that puny health bar? That puny health bar? You know what? Just for you, I'm beating your ass. Bring that ass here, boy. The three hitter here, since we don't have Namba, which sucks. But this should work. Kick him in the nuts? Yes. I still love this. I hope we get new mayhem abilities in the future. I think we only get something new if it's with like a new party member. I hope we get more. Ah, yes. And now give me your nuts yet again. <laughs> Too freaking easy, seriously. Fuck, Ron. You fraud. I can't believe you. Oh, okay. さん、流役者のくせに金で揉めて映画の出演料だったかで揉めてその勢いでプロデューサーを殴ったんでしょ一時期その話でも付切りでしたよいやこいつはマネージャーの女の子を助けようとして結果的に殴っちまっただけだろ
三流は私の方か確かにあの事件のことはろくに調べないで報道の内容を勝手に信じていました本当に情けない写真は全て消しましたもうデータはありませんそうか春日さん今日は本当にありがとうございましたいや大したことはしてねえし気にすんないそれよりあんたの復活応援してるぜありがとうございますですが理由はどうであれ問題を起こしてしまったことは事実ですそれをなかったことにして先へ進むつもりはありませんこの町の人たちにも迷惑をかけてしまいました私のこれまでの行い一つ一つをしっかりと受け止めてこれからお返ししていければと考えていますそしてまた一人でも多くの人たちに感動を与えられるような役者を目指します<笑>まあこの間のファンみたいにあんたの演技で元気づけられる人は多いだろうししっかり頑張んなはいこれは少ないですけど感謝の気持ちです受け取ってくださいそれでは失礼しますおうそれでは失礼しますそれでは失礼しますそれでは失礼しますそれでは失礼しますそれでは失礼しますそれでは失礼しますそれでは失礼しますなんだか久しぶりにいい写真が撮れた気がします新しい一歩を踏み出そうとする一人の役者のねたまにはスキャンダルじゃなくて人の背中を押すような記事を書くのもいいですねほうイリュージョン電撃復活長い沈黙を破り決意のリスタート宣言なんてどうでしょう<笑>いいんじゃねえか改めて彼に取材を申し込もうと思いますもちろん事件の真相を書くような野暮な真似はしませんがあんなにまっすぐな顔を見せられちゃ応援したくなっちゃいますよ確かになそれじゃいい記事期待してるぜあサインもらっておけばよかったな <laughs> I guess <laughs> that's all right. Oh, okay. Ilya Jin is a power mate. Okay. I wonder what his ability is. That's interesting. Man, these sub stars are amazing, bro. u h Well, I guess next one's up. Gonna be cooking up what grandma got. We still have one more kimchi left, mind you. So I wonder if we're gonna give it to the old lady. This will be very interesting to see what goes on here. Uh, what the heck was that? Oh, okay, there's an item over here. Street dandy. Interesting. That's something new. Well, anyways, other than that, we got the old lady up here, so. Let's see if we can help her accomplish her goal of getting across this street. How you doing, lady? It's been a while. <laughs> バーサーまだ信号で苦戦してたんだなんおお兄ちゃんかそうなんよいいところまでは行くんじゃがもう少しのところで信号が点滅し始めてなあ、はあ私は私は私は私は私は私は私は私は私は私は私は私は私イダテウメちゃんなんて呼ばれとったのに。My decades ago was that? 信号もろくに渡れん、追いぼれになってしまった。もう一度でいいから、早く走ってみたいの。バーサー、若い頃走りに自信があったから、余計に自分の足で進むことにこだわってたんだな。あの伝説のキムチで道が開けた連中もいた。信号が変わるタイミングでこのばあさんにもキムチを食べさせてみようか
I freaking knew it. I love this game. This is the best game for Substory so far. They just come. We just combined two different substories together here. I just want to say that. That's freaking amazing, man. Share the kimchi. Let's see it. Baza. Shingo ga ao ni naru timing de kore o kutte mite kure. Ah? Nan ja kore? Kimchi ja nai ka. Ah. Chotto bakashi shigeki ga tsuyoi ga kore o kueba ano koro mitei ni hayaku hashireru kamo shire ne. Hmm? Shoujiki. Ah, just freaking eat it. Be like Popeye. Come on. Oh, Watch her stand up straight, I'ma call it. Hello. Hope she didn't run into the wall. Yatara, <laughs> それもこれも どこ I guess so. Yeah, one more thing to end that sub story. I'll have to see about that. But, oh god, this, this game is something else, man. This has been, like, some of the most interesting, but usually that's just how sub stories are. They're very interesting and very different, man. Ah, man, I love this game. I knew I would, but Jesus Christ, this... This just takes the cake, man, seriously. This just continues to make my day through and through. Alright, here we are. The old guy there, I see a pot there, kimchi. Oh, several. Ah, the old lady's here. Oh, Kyoka. Yeah, that's not bad. Nice job, man. It's only thanks to Kasuga over here, but still nice. Mm -hmm. まあ、元気に今売れてるんだし、いいじゃねえか。癖になる味だし、きっとリピーターだってつくさ。それでといいかな。キムチ一つくださいな。おっと。じゃあ、俺は行くぜ。商売の邪魔しちゃ悪いから
Amazing. <laughs> oh, I love this game. The Miracle of Spice. Seriously. Oh, you mecca. Oh! So you apply for each of my confections. You can hire the candidate at the management menu. I will be sure to remember that because I definitely need to go back there at some point. Just remember that. Oh, boy. Well, with that done, can I buy some kimchi, actually? Let me do that. Good healing. Let me get some of that since I have 300,000 yen in there. Damn there. Ah, yes. Thank you, Lutz. All right. So that's, what, three substories down? There's still another one here we need to do, so I already know what's going to go on here, so let's get there. Okay. Who is this guy? Aren't you President Ichiban Kasuga? What the hell? I've actually been working on this great business proposal that will totally take company to new heights, want to hear it? Contract capital investment close. Please tell me it didn't like take like one million yen to get this guy, or is this like a location I have to do. I'll send you the doc so you can see for yourself how genius it is. You're gonna go crazy for this idea, I swear. A new investment proposal. I review this and make a decision back at the office. What the fuck? Uh, this definitely reminds me of the real estate business with Curry back in Yakuza Zero. Because I remember I had to go to specific locations to buy off stuff to make the business thrive more. I wonder how this is going to go, but I guess I'll leave that to when I can actually get to that. Okay. Here we are, finally continuing a sub story of some sort. What is this over here? Oh, the sports shop. I'm trying to remember. It's been quite a while since I've actually, you know, focused on that substrate, per se. Okay, so there's the little kid. Oh, so I did go over here to check for the glove, right? See if he wanted that. Guess it's worth a shot to see if anyone even have it, unless someone literally just <laughs> bought it. That would suck. And that just happened. Wow, having a Sotoyama glove in my hands is unreal. Gotta say, though, taking the second to last one feels like sliding into home here and the umpire yells, SAFE! <laughs> but these are selling fast, huh? That bright red color sets my heart on fire. Hmm. Shoot. There's only one left and things aren't looking good for Nobura. Oh. Maybe I should get it from him before anyone else can? Yeah, sounds like a plan. Excuse me. Oh. Wait. Mm -hmm. Tame-chan. Hello there. You're here for the glove, aren't you? The Sotiyama model. I don't know if that's his mother or not, so this could prove to be struggle time. I don't know who she is. <laughs> Did she reserve it ahead of time? Yes, I'm finally ready to buy it. It's been such a hard month. I hardly know how to manage to scrape the money together. Yeah, saving money in this economy is no easy feat. Well, Kasuga, you better pray that's his mother. <laughs> and this glove is the priciest one on the shelf. I'm sure I hope your son likes it. <laughs> For him, it's a small price to pay. He's normally very reserved, doesn't speak his mind. This is the first time he's really asked me for anything. That's how I know how much he wanted this. That lady's son sounds like an awful lot like Nobura. Yeah. You know, I have to leave him all by himself most nights, but right now, there's just no other option. So I'm hoping this can make up for it, some of it anyway. I'm sure he understands. The only reason you're away is because you're working hard for the both of you. He knows without a doubt you're a fantastic mother. Aww. I sure hope so. Anyway, I'm glad I made it on time. 
Nah, I'm taking him out for dinner after this. I'm used to going out all the time back when my husband was still alive. Oh, uh, you had to just say that. Well, hey, you better get on over to him. Don't keep the birthday boy waiting. Yeah, this sounds like Nobura. Huh? So she really is Nobura's mom. Happy for you, kid. You do have a great mother. Oh, hell no. Oh, you are not doing this shit. Uh-uh. Help, thief. Yeah, I got you, ma'am. Oh, no. I'm trying you all right. Uh, don't worry about me. The glove is more important. All right, Ichiban. Let's get this guy. It's gonna feel good rocking new brand new Satoyama. Bet I could f with the, uh, what? What? Oh hell no! That's the jerk who stole the world's glove. All right, now stay there. Hey, now thief. You know what I'm here for, right? You didn't seriously chase me down just to get a glove, did you? Yeah, it's not a glove, my guy. That glove is a little birthday kid or a little kid's birthday present, Jesus. And you need to give it back, buddy. Uh -huh. Not a chance in hell. This you can sell for me to get on the internet. I don't give a damn how much you think it's worth. What's more precious than a kid's smile or a mother's love? He doesn't care about that. Back it up with that mushy shit. I'll kick your ass. <laughs> Again, with you weak ass people, really? Bring that ass here, boy. <laughs> and if you don't mind me just quickly taking that, thank you. There, how's that for mushy? Oh no, are you okay? What you mean? That thief. Did you confront him? You're not hurt, are you? Uh, don't worry about it. Also, don't fall in love with me. That will be bad. Uh, hardly a scratch on me. More importantly, here yeah, is yours. Arigato. Ah, my son's glove. Oh, how can I ever thank you? I'm afraid I don't have much to offer you, but please take this. Maximum mittens? Hey, I'll take it. <laughs> Might come in use. Who knows? You saved my son's birthday. Yeah, a really wonderful person. <laughs> as long as the bird gets his present, I'm a happy guy. Now go make his birthday wish come true, huh? Oh, okay. Wait, how do you know his name? Glad I could get that glove back. Let's just check up on Noburu in a bit, make sure it all goes well. Ha! Oh, we're all the way at Janai Station. What the hell? Okay, well, see you guys in a second. Okay, I guess this is where things are checking up here. So what's going on over here? Oh, Noboru, you're over here? Okay. Guess that makes sense. そわそわしてんな。まだ母ちゃんは来てねえのか登るお。登る。待たせてごめんね。あ、お母さん。うん、大丈夫だよ。はい。誕生日おめでとう、登る。おお。これって谷山スポーツ用品だの。袋から出していい。プレゼントは逃げないよ。中に入ってからにしなさい。はい。寒いし、中に入ろうか。今日は何でも好きなものを頼んでいいよ。何がいい？お母さんと一緒に食べられるなら、僕何でもいいよ。登
うん寂しかったけどもう大丈夫それに春日さんって人が友達になってくれたし春日さん誰なんだいそれは<笑>中で話すよ。ハッピーバースデー、ノボル。ジジーズオンだ。あ、ノボルはアプリフォーイチバープコンフェクション。Are you sure about that? I thought the mother of all people would, but then again, I don't think we really caught one of her names, so I guess we'll have to keep it at that. All right. With that in mind, we only have two more sub stories left, so we have to continue this main story. Man, these sub stories are hitting hard, and I'm enjoying it so far. I hope you guys are as well. It kind of sucks that I'm doing it this way, but I'm doing this for both my sake and everyone who's watching this series, so that you guys can get all the content right now instead of after the story is finished. Or you guys could just wait several days till these go up just to hear the story continue. But then again, I still feel bad for that. It, whatever the case may be, this is for the sake of my extra story. Because every Yakuza game seems to have it. Even a game that isn't Yakuza, question mark, question mark. A quick nudge, nudge. Another game I don't know if I should play or not, but there is a little Easter egg in it. But I'll leave it at that. Anyways, outside of that, let's just continue on and finish up the remaining sub stories and continue on with the main story. Let's go, let's go.